Hey everybody, what's going on? Speedy Diver back at it again with another Z-Box unboxing. Now, sadly the pricing, shipping labels and all that have been put over the, the actual logo of Z-Box so you can't even really see it. And also the the wording that says Z-Box. Now, uh, that's kind of sad because I always, I don't know, I, I like to show off the box a little bit. But either way, this month is for the month of March 2020, baby. And uh, I, I could be mistaken, but I think the theme is Invasion. I believe, and uh, they hinted a way of what could be inside, like actual themes of what could be in here, like different kinds of uh, like things basically, different companies, but I'm not gonna spoil it for you guys. Also, if you don't know what a Z-Box is, it's a mystery box made for geeks, if you can kind of make that wording out. Yeah, just a little bit. <laughs> So uh, if you guys do want to uh, pick one of these up, I'll leave the uh, shipping, uh, not shipping, I'll leave the, uh, yeah, the pricing and shipping in the description below for the pricing of what, how much this costs, as well as a link to Z-Box if you guys are interested. And uh, I'm excited. Let's get into it. Also over here, it says Z-Box, hashtag Z-Box in the comments below. Also their Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Over here, they still add Zavi and Men's XL, because that's what I am, guys. I'm an extra large. Spoiler alert. <laughs> so that obviously obviously means there's a shirt inside if it says that. So uh, let's rip on open and see what it says. It says record, share, and love, which I always do this every month, and I really, really do. And I got this one, this Z-Box, really quick because uh, it actually just... Like month, like the month of March is like in the middle of March right now. I usually get this at the end of the month. So definitely really awesome. And I am definitely seeing something that I'm liking. Pennywise, it. And a piece of paper, which I think is going to say what it is. So we're not going to take that. We're actually going to look at this first because this is obviously the giant item in the box. Boom. What is it? Boom. boom. It is. Oh, it is. Oh, I don't know if you guys can see this, if it'll focus in on this, hold on, right there, yeah, it says Z-Box Special Edition, this is one of these Z-Box exclusives, yes, they actually didn't do one of these last month, which I was a little disappointed about, but they did another one this month, oh, it's Pennywise, that looks so cool, sorry I have to hold it on an angle, it's just the reflection of the lighting is going to make it look really, really weird if I don't, so, uh, that is... We are taking this out of the box and definitely checking it out. It is from Minico, and it says horror down here as well. All oh, that is so cool. It's a Z-Box exclusive. You can only get this in Z-Box that I'm aware of. I'm pretty sure you can only get it in Z-Box, and that is it. That is, oh man. Georgie, oh my gosh. That is really, really cool. Oh, I like it. Now, if we do look at this, before we look at the figure, if we look at this paper really quick, it should say what it's all about. Pennywise B&W figure by Minico, available exclusively to Zavi, which Zavi is Z-Box. It's the mother company, basically. And uh, stay tuned for our next exclusive. So they're coming out with new ones every month. And I actually have another one of these I want to show you guys that we got two months ago. I actually have it on my shelf over here. I haven't even opened it yet. Well, I did for the video, but it's over here. Hold on. Let me get it. I still actually have it in the bubble wrap, too, right here. I just wanted to show this to you guys really quickly because this was another exclusive to Z-Box. Uh, Z-Box blows me away. There, see another exclusive right here? It's a Batman. Literally on the, I don't even know what it's called, but the light for Batman. The Bat light. I don't know. I don't know what it's called. And it even has some little Joker remnants on there as well. Oh, it's just so cool. Like they're really, really detailed figures. Like look at the base. That is so freaking cool. He looks like a pop figure kind of. A little bit, because his head's a little more like a pop, kind of in a way. But uh, as you can see, they have different ones. This is the first one that they ever released, at least the one that I got. And uh, the second one is now the Pennywise. And as you can see, they have di they obviously have different ones. There's a uh, Harley Quinn, a Harry Potter, which I want the Harry Potter. Oh, I want that one so bad. And the uh, Aquaman. If you guys don't know, I like Harry Potter, and I also love Harley Quinn. So those two... Would be cool. Aquaman also looks really good. So, uh, Pennywise. That is so sick. And it's black and white, too. So let's get the trusty, a uh, dusty, a uh, knife. Yeah, the Batarang knife. Let's get it. And let's get into this box. Be nice and careful. Because, uh, this is so exciting. Like, let's... Oh, man. This is... He's holding the balloon. Oh, it's just... This is really, really cool. Let's get a better angle on that. Oh, man. Packaging, 
on point here. I don't want to damage the figure, so I'm being very careful with it. Kind of. Uh oh. Oh. Uh. Right when I say I'm being careful with the figure, did I just break it? Oh, I'm going to be so sad if that just broke. I hope it goes back together. Uh, either way, <laughs> oh man, that was not supposed to happen. At least I don't think it was. Uh, please tell me this goes back in. Okay, it does. Oh, oh, okay, it does go back in. It has the little grommet to slide it back into place. Oh my gosh, that was scary. Yep, it should just slide right back in. Hopefully, there we go. Oh my gosh, that was scary. He's holding the little paper boat and he's holding the red balloon. That is so sick. Like that is so cool. That is so cool. And I like how down here it actually says it Pennywise. The base is not nearly as cool as the Batman figure one, but it's still really, really cool. Minico Pennywise on the bottom here, made in China. Uh, anything else? Warner Brothers, obviously. Uh, da -da -da -da. Yeah, that's, that's what it's saying. That is so cool. I like his hair. I'm not a huge fan of the, like, the black and white figures. I'm just not a fan of, like, black and white figures in general. But I think what makes this one stand out is that it has the red balloon. That's what I think makes it really cool. Like, if it was just an all black and white figure, I probably wouldn't like it at all. But I really think it's cool because his eyes stand out and the balloon stands out. And also, obviously, it down here stands out. So I think that is a very, very, very cool touch why they made it black and white like that. That is very cool. Oh, I love that figure. I love these exclusive figures. Like, I really do. They are so freaking cool. We didn't get one last month, but we got one the month before. So maybe every other month they're giving them away. I'm not sure. But uh, this alone is worth the price of a Z-Box, in my opinion. Like, just look at the pricing details, guys, in the description. It's so worth it. Like, that is... That is so cool. I don't even have like a special link or anything where I make money off any of this stuff. Like I, I don't do any of that. I just, I like this company that much that I think it is so cool to show you guys these because these are such cool figures. Like really, really cool. Love that figure so much. Let's see what else we might have in this uh, Z box and see what is up. I love it. Oh man. We have the packaging material. Always great. We have a, oh, this is Rick and Morty. Yeah, we have a Rick and Morty t-shirt it looks like. Rick and Morty Adult Swim. Let's check it out. I think it's a t-shirt. Probably. It is a... Yeah, it's looking like a t-shirt. What is this? A piece of paper. <laughs> that was inside the shirt. Okay. Uh, it is also another one of these, which is a nice canvas, the Vela canvases. These are really nice t-shirts. They're not like regular, like uh, just every normal day t-shirts. They're actually really nice and soft. And uh, I really recommend these t-shirts as well that they give away. They're really nice. This one, it does say Peace Among Worlds, Rick and Morty. Now, this is one show I don't watch. I know my sister does, so uh, maybe I'll give it to her as like a night shirt or something because it is obviously a little bit, like a lot bigger than what she is. So uh, definitely pretty cool though. I mean, maybe I'll wear it. I just, I just don't know much about Rick and Morty and I don't want to wear something I really don't know much about. So uh, either way though, a really nice t-shirt, nice and soft, nice print as well, really nice. There's still more in the box, by the way. We have a keychain for, ooh. That is cool. Jurassic Park. That's not English. What is this? Okay. It says limited edition key ring numbered on reverse. So these are limited edition maybe? Like, like it's, I know it says limited edition, but like they're actually numbered limited edition. There's a difference between having a limited edition thing and a limited edition thing that's actually numbered. So uh, I like that is so cool. I don't know what that is, if it's Chinese, Japanese, something else, I do not know. If anyone does know and you can read that, please let me know. It might even tell us. Jurassic Park limited edition key, no, it doesn't tell us. Um, it says they're limited to 9,995 worldwide. So not even 10,000 of these were ever made. And yes, I'm gonna open it, I don't care. You know, I don't care. I'm trying to, I wanted to read the back of this to see what it says. Manufactured under license by that. Da, 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 da. It says made in China on the bottom, but that doesn't mean that it's Chinese. I don't know why it looks like that. Like why, what it is. I'm trying to read it here, but uh, either way, I like it. It's an all metal keychain, and that's also something I wanted to see if it was metal or plastic. That's all metal. That is really cool. I don't even care that this is limited edition, to be honest, because I want to put this on my keychain. Like that is a really, really cool keychain. I like that a lot. Oh man. 
Like, I'm not the biggest Jurassic Park fan. I mean, obviously, I love Jurassic Park and Jurassic World. I think they're awesome. But uh, that is so cool, though. I just think that looks really, really cool because it doesn't say Jurassic Park in English. It says it in some other language. That is very interesting. I definitely do like that. Well, let's see what else we have in here because there is more. Ooh, this one's heavy, whatever it is. The heck is this? Oh, it's a bottle opener. Oh, what? Oh, that's actually really cool. And it also says it's a magnet for easy storage. Bottle opener. This is from Alien vs. Predator, right? Am I wrong? This is not... Yeah, it's from Alien 40th Anniversary. Okay. It's... Oh, it's just coming out? Oh, okay. Apparently, it just comes right out. Um, this... What is this? Oh, it's a little twist tie. Um, this right here is cool because it's a magnet. Oh, and even on the back, it says it. Oh, it's engraved. Alien, it's like literally like engraved. Alien 40th anniversary, 1979 to 2019. So it's obviously new. Uh, magnet there, magnet there. It's a nice bottle opener. It's got some good weight to it. This is, I forget what they call these. These are either alien. I always call them something wrong. They're either, I always call them head humpers. <laughs> but I think they're called like face huggers or head huggers or something. I, they're like the little baby babies or whatever that like come out of the eggs and they jump on your face or head i don't know i forget what they're called but i always call them something stupid but either way definitely really cool i don't have anything that's is this magnetized yeah so this is a magnet see i don't know yeah it can, i can kind of show it to you guys see it holds it so it's pretty cool you can put it on your fridge if you still have a magnetic fridge like on the sides or something but uh that is actually really cool I really like that. It's got like a really good weight. This is solid metal, by the way. It's all metal. So definitely not going to break on you. And then that looks like that is it for this month's Z-Box for March. Now, I do have to be honest with you guys. I love Z-Box. I think I, I know it sounds like I'm exaggerating way too much in this video like I always do. But I don't think there's a better box out there that you're going to get your money's back. Like your, not your money's, your money worth. Your money's worth your money back in what you're actually buying. You get a limited edition keychain, only 10,000 of them made worldwide. Super cool. And I got one of them. Also, the Rick and Morty t-shirt. This is an easy $15 t-shirt alone. And that's almost the price of the box. This alone basically pays for the box, which is just mind-blowing to me. Definitely really freaking awesome. There's the Alien 40th Anniversary bottle opener. This is definitely going to come in handy. I'm going to use this. You can never have too many bottle openers. That's a fact. Also, there is the, uh, the Pennywise from It. Like, that is, it's got good weight to it, by the way. Like, it's actually premium quality, a premium figure. Like, look at the detail. I don't know if I showed you guys the detail that much, but it's just, besides the arm coming off, but that's, it's allowed to do that because it has that little socket, whatever. See, it has that thing where you can take it on and off. So, I guess maybe there could be accessories to this. I, I don't know. I'm, I'm not too sure. But either way, I love that red balloon. It is so cool. Obviously, that's hollow. Yeah, you can hear it. But that is, oh, it just looks so good. It looks better in person. I'm not going to lie. So uh, with all that being said, guys, I'm going to quickly let you guys know what I think everything is worth individually, and uh, then I'll be wrapping it up. First things first, the t-shirt, 15 bucks, Easy $15 to $20 value. The keychain, since it is limited edition, I would give this a 6 to 7 Seven dollar. I would pay seven bucks for this. I actually really like this keychain. I think it's really, really cool. So cool keychain, seven bucks. The uh, bottle opener for Aliens 40th Edition. I would pay. This is probably a good five to seven dollar bottle opener. Like it's it's got really good weight to it. Also, it is kind of like a collectible bottle opener if you love the Alien movies and Alien vs Predator and all that stuff. And then there's also the It Pennywise figure. I don't even know what I priced this one at last, but uh, two months ago or whatever. But um. I don't know. This is a good $25 figure. I love it. Like, I, I haven't seen too much of the newer It's. Like, I know he's the newer It, obviously. But the original It movies, that, like, the, the part one and part two of the original It, love them when I grew up. I always watched those. I thought they were really, really good. And uh, that alone, this makes this priceless to me, to be honest, because I think it is so, so cool. But I would give this a uh, $25 value, 30 bucks. It could even be like a thirty, a thirty-five dollar figure. Like it is really, really nice. So uh, enough of me saying how nice it is. If you want one of these boxes, check out the link in the description and find out for yourself. And with all that being said, guys, thanks so much for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Instagram and Twitter below. And when you do subscribe, click the little bell notification so you can get notifications. And I will be leaving the, all the unboxings of Z boxes over here. There's a ton of them. So if you're still undecided, go check those videos out. Also, the last video over here or the best recommended for you, just check that one out as well. Also, my gaming channel. 
channel and this channel down here too. Subscribe and check these out. Yeah. <laughs> Come back tomorrow for another epic video and I'll catch you guys on the flip side.